the ME51N transaction is used to create a purchase requisition. This procedure is used to manually enter a purchase requisition in GFIPS for the purpose of funds check and commitment of funds. Note, manually entered PRs are subject to workflow approvals. Now, we will demonstrate how to create a purchase requisition in GFIPS. Type the transaction code ME51N in the command field and press enter. Click on the document type drop down menu and select SPSPR. Enter a short description of what is being procured in the header note field. In this instance, it's medical supplies. Expand the item overview section. Enter P in the account assignment field. Note, the account assignment designates the cost object. K is equivalent to cost center, F is equivalent to internal order, P is equivalent to WBS element, and U is equivalent to unfunded. Enter medical supplies in the short text field. Enter 1 in the quantity field. Enter each EA in the unit of measure field. Enter an amount in the valuation price field. Enter the delivery date in the text field. Enter 262R in the material group field. Enter FSHA in the plant field. Enter 24M in the purchasing group. Note. Purchasing group represents the last three alphanumeric combinations of the DODAC for the contracting office. Enter TD Green in the requisitioner field. Enter Army in the purchasing organization field. Note, the purchasing organization is always Army. Press the Enter key to validate the entries. In the Item Details section, click on the Account Assignment tab and enter S.00000 Press the Enter key to populate the WBS information. Click on the Customer Data tab, PRGen Sub tab, and enter the full name and telephone number of the POC.
click on the workflow tab and enter W87JNL in the requester approver DODAC text field. Note, the DODAC information determines the routing approval process. Click on the Contracts tab and enter 423-450 in the next field. Enter 6515 in the PSC text field. Press the Enter key to validate the information. In the Item Overview section, highlight Line Item 1 by clicking the gray box to the very left of the line item. Click on the Copy icon. Update the short text to the description of line 2. In this instance, enter medical gowns. Validate the quantity. Change the unit of measure to CV and change the valuation price text field to 1000. Press the enter key to validate the information. Click on the drop down arrow and select line item 2 in which you have copied. On the Customer Data tab, Contract Sub tab, update the data in the NAICS and PSC text fields if applicable. Click the Check button on the menu bar for a systematic check of the purchase requisition. Notice the information message in the display in the status bar in the lower left hand corner of the screen. Click the save button on the menu bar. Note, the informational message in the bottom left of the screen stating purchase requisition number was created. Record your document number. You have successfully completed this transaction.